guys, welcome to the H&M Reloaded channel. I'm your boy Michael, and today we have received a little present in the mail from the good guys at Gulu Portable Jump Starter. They sent us this brand new Gulu GT4000. Okay, to collab with, and this has the preheat technology in it. Okay. And let's see what it has. This is the JS271 model. Okay. The capacity is 88.8 .8 watt hour. The starting current is 800 amp for three seconds. And the peak current is 4,000 amps. Okay. And here's some other little information you can see. I'm trying to get the light off there for you. All right, also this will do gasoline engines up to 12 liter, 12 liter gasoline engines and 10 liter diesel engine. How about that? That's amazing. This has many security features in it. It's got 10 smart safety protections, overcharge protection, overcurrent protection, short circuit protection, reverse polarity protection, AI software protection, high and low temp protection, spark proof protection, over voltage protection, overload protection and reverse charge protection. All that in this GT4000 by Gulu. Let's open her up. A while back we had actually, we already reviewed this a while ago, a long time ago, about a year ago, maybe a little bit more than that. And we were having a problem with the preheat technology in the old one, okay? Here, here's the new one. I already charged this, just so you know. Here's the new GT4000, the huge LCD screen. I'm going to turn it on for you. It's at 88%. I did charge it up before, but I also, I jump-started the car already. We're doing this in reverse order. <laughs> but I jump-started the car already, and I also tested the preheat technology before anything. That's why it's at 88% right now. Okay, here's the reverse. You can see it. A lot of useful information on here. I'm sure you can see it. Perfect. Okay, this goes off automatically after about a minute. And this is your boost button up here in case you have a battery with less than 7 volts. You click the boost and ready will illuminate. See it? But keep in mind when the ready is on, there's live power in this at all times. So all those security features I just mentioned are useless. Okay? Always keep that in mind. When you're, when you hit the boost button, you're just disabling the protections. That's it, okay? And your Gulu GT4000 comes with a nylon bag to carry it in. I would have much rather seen a hard case than a nylon bag, because this, these, um, if I paid for it, this is, uh, when I bought this, it was $249, I believe it was. Now it's a little bit less. I think it's a little under 200, I believe. And as usual, you get the manual with a lot of useful information. You must read it. Okay, and you get the eight gauge 200C wire. Okay, connector. And I only see the wire on the top of this, on the, on, I don't see the wire on the bottom, but if you look on the back, you can't see the wire on the top and bottom, but you can see it on the bottom, naturally. Some of them have it on the top and bottom, but nevertheless, you're going to get power either way. And these are nice and thick, spring-loaded, copper-plated, I believe. And yeah, um... See, these are very fat. I wish they were a little bit thinner too, so we can get into those hard-to-reach battery clamps. But it'll work, you know, it'll work great. You know, they want an honest review, so that's what they're getting. See? Nice clamps. Very heavy-duty clamps, I might add. And you get the wiring, you get US Type-C to US Type-C, USB-C, USB-C. And you'll see the, well, the ports right here. The jump starter port right here. 
you get the 12 volt here get the USB a USB fast and over here is your USB C to charge because this is also a power bank guys it's a very strong power bank you could you could um, uh, power you know anything from cameras laptops iPads sporting equipment camping equipment uh, whatever you can think of this is gonna this is gonna power it this is very very heavy duty and again this is 88.8 .8 watt hour okay all right also power delivery is 100 watt for your car vehicle plus it has a USB AC through right there a pass-through so if this is plugged in if this is plugged in already to your lighter port you have an additional USB connection right there and this is a hundred watt super fast PD okay All right. and also you get a USB A to USB C charging wire okay you know, so you either get the USB-C, USB-C, to USB-C, USB-A. Okay, and also you get the 12 volt female adapter power source. So you stick your cigarette lighter male adapter in here, and you would put it in here. Here, I'll show you. You could power your small refrigerators, um, a number of things you could use that require the cigarette style adapter. Okay, that's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Okay. And yeah, I just wanted to bring up the other GT4000 that we had in the past, just because a lot of people were thinking that the preheat technology didn't work in any of them, and that was not the case. I'm here to tell you because we had a defective unit, the other defective unit, and when you see the video outside, like right after this, you're gonna see both of them side by side, okay? And you're gonna know there's really two of them, not just one, but there's two of them. And guys, the Gulu products, they're amazing. They've always have been amazing. That's why I wanted to do this video because like I said, I've already reviewed this on YouTube already. I already have a couple of, of videos about Gulu. These jump starters are lifesavers. There's no more need for the the two cars and the big long cables, you know, to get to both cars. Just keep this, you know, in your car somewhere, you know, under the hood, um, under the trunk. Keep it under your seat. Keep it anywhere. But guys, great unit to have. And like I said, I just wanted to show them, give them their props, because like I said, Gulu is a great company. Let's go outside. We're going to do it in five, four, three, two. One, see if it works. Obviously, you see the snowflake on there, so it's very, very cold. This is the newest one. Let's see how cold it is. Negative five, is that right? No, that's on C. It's at 21 degrees. Okay, I had it in the freezer for a little while, but. Turn it back on. You see the snowflake right there showing it's in preheat mode. Now you hit the boost. There you go. Now, a proper GT4000 is going to show the heated emoji there. And it's going to go down. Negative 14 it's showing. Negative 12, negative 11. That's just... As you see, the power is going down also to 98. We started at 100%. Now, once this hits operating temperature, negative 4, negative 3. It should go straight to jump start mode. Let's give it a couple seconds here. There you go. Now it's in the proper mode. See, you see the ready? There you go. We have another GT4000 that was giving us problems with the preheat technology, but I just wanted to show you the new one and how it's properly supposed to work. All right, guys? That's how it's supposed to work. You saw it. We're gonna go outside in a minute and show you exactly how it works on a V8 with no voltage. Show you that this V8, that this V8 Cadillac is indeed dead. We have one volt. 
1.079 volts. Okay, it's all connected. Again. Right on. Again. Okay, I'm gonna click it here. There we go. 1.079 volts. So obviously, one volt is not enough. So we are gonna pull the Gulu GC4000 out of the freezer in a second, and we are gonna show in living color if it works properly, the preheat technology. We have a defective GT4000. We've had it for about seven, eight months. I paid for it out of my own pocket. Uh, but this time, Gulu GT4000, the company Gulu, forgive the noise in the background, I'm on the main road, but Gulu company has sent me a brand new GT4000 to test for all of you guys because this one is going to work. This one is definitely going to work. The GT4000 is made very well as I've said many times in my past videos. All right guys, here we go. Here is the good Gulu GT4000 and here's the defective one I had a long time ago. You're going to see when I turn it on. You actually see the cable you see the snowflake lit up it does not come on now when you do this one sit it hit the boost boom there it is see it okay everything's hooked up already after all those numbers get off the screen it's able to jump start see it there you go. It should be able to jump start now. And keep in mind, guys. This battery had one volt, as we saw a couple minutes ago. Down here. Okay, it's all hooked up down there. On here. Obviously, there's one volt, so this unit does not sense that there's a battery. Let's hit the boost. It's just ready, doesn't it? Oh, ready? Here we go. Let's see if the new Gulu GT4000 is strong enough to jump start. The 2004 Cadillac V8. Here we go. Here we go. Got it over here. Go. Start it right up, guys. Woo! There it is. That's the Gulu GT4000. The new one. There's the new one. A long time ago, I actually bought this one with my own money. Okay? It's work it works to this day perfectly. However, the preheat technology in this one does not work that good. Sometimes it'll work, sometimes it won't. This one, the good people at Gulu sent me a brand new one for me to test and review. This one, obviously, we turned it on. And if there's no snowflake, that means the preheat technology, there's no need for it. If there's no snowflake. If there's a snowflake, like there is here, well, the snowflake is right under here. There you go. See how the snowflake is? This means the unit is ice cold, okay? It's under 32 degrees, and it needs the preheat technology to come on in order to jumpstart. As we all see, and this one works great, I just showed you guys, okay? So yeah, with this one here, I just want to show you guys here. You know, see how the, the snowflake is on? I'm going to put the old one. I'm sure a lot of people are saying, Mike, put the old cables in the, I mean, put the new cables in the new unit well no in the old unit i'm sorry okay okay guys this is the old unit with the snowflake still illuminated see it now we are gonna hook it up see what happens okay got that one there and see the snowflake it's kind of funny because like they say wait where is it hang on, a second. Oh, hang on. okay there it is this is the old defective unit I put the new cables that just that I just got the new cables I just got these like yesterday or two days ago and you see the snowflake still there you hit the boost button and it just says ready the preheat technology never came on that indicates to me that it's a defective unit like I've been told by many people so we're gonna try to start it it might start but the preheat technology will not start you know that will not work huh Oh, there it goes. It just started. Just started up. <laughs> How about that? See that? I gave it a second chance. Let's see. Yep. And if you notice, the snowflake is still on. See? It's a zero code. 
This is the, the old defective one. An amazing product. I've always liked Gulu. I've never had an issue with Gulu. Never. You know, I just wanted to give Gulu the redemption because, you know, I knew I had a defective unit. I just wanted to prove that the new one worked properly. Yeah, so guys, what can you say about the Gulu GT4000? It works perfectly every time. Preheat technology, you saw it in action. You saw the preheat technology working in action. I think it was uh, it was under 32 degrees, but this is advertised to work under uh, in up to, or I should say, in down to negative 40 degrees, negative 40. That's amazing, guys. All right, well, this is your boy Michael with the H&M Reloaded channel. Click that subscribe button, guys. Hey, you'll have good luck for the next 10 years if you click the subscribe button. Guys, it actually works. You will have good luck for the next 10 years. Try it. You'll see. Shake your neighbor's hand as usual. And guys, we love you guys. Peace out.